contest is set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing 189 pounds, Pineapple. Oh, oof. Not a good way to start a match when you're dealing with the Murder Hawk monster. Lance Archer just absolutely blindsiding Pineapple Peak. Jake Roberts loves it, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch out. Oh. Lance very nearly took out Jake the Snake Roberts. Yeah, better check on Jake. Well, I got a feeling you might have to end up checking on Pineapple Peak because as if the Murder Hawk monster's not pissed off enough all the time. Oh, rising strike there by Pineapple Pete. He's standing toe to toe with Lance Archer. Wow. Step up, Enzi Gary. He's got Archer rattled. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, That's you had a him mistake rattled. right there. That's a mistake. You can't deal with that power and athleticism of, of Big Lance. Oh, man. Well, look at Pete. Pineapple Pete escaping out the back door. Right wow. and left of the midsection. Big right hand, but Archer just ate it for lunch, Taz. Just chucked him on a mat. Like, look at Jake is all pissed off. Look, I'll tell you what, one step ahead is Pineapple Pete. Pineapple oh, Pete yeah. did not come to play. I'm telling you. He's here trying to pick up his first oh. victory in AEW. And Pineapple Pete. Pineapple oh, Pete. Joey Janela, the bad boy in the crowd, getting in the face of Archer. Those two men will meet on the second night of Fighter Fest coming up on July 8th. I wish Joey would have left his shirt on. Yeah, Archer's not a happy camper. There's Pineapple Pete. Hits the ropes, but Archer, oh! Archer had it, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. And oh, oh God. my God! Right on, on the corner bead of the apron. There's metal on the, oh wow, just, yeah, I tell you. <laughs> Be careful, Joey. Be careful with that, with Lance Archer. Murder Hawk Monster Lance Archer. Yeah. Man. May have ended the night of Pineapple Pete already. But he continues to lay in the punishment. Driving Pineapple Pete's spine on that on that corner of the apron. There's metal under there where everything meets like a right angle. And there's a big steel corner bead right there. And I, let's take a look here. Watch this where I'm talking about. Watch this next Calvin man. Right on the spine. Right on the corner bead. That is, that's intent to hurt someone pretty bad. And I respect that and love that with Jake Roberts is putting in the head of, of Lance. Cover there, Pineapple Pete. Kicking out, though. And Lance Archer walking down Rick Knox. Yeah, Rick Knox, you definitely, I know Rick Knox has been a few scrapes in his day, but you gotta be careful. No, he's not Maybe been in not. a scrape with anybody yeah. quite like Lance Archer. I don't think he's ever been in a scrape. Maybe I went too far. No, he, Rick Knox has been in, he can take care of himself. I hear you. Oh, that oh. close right in the back of the head, dude. The clubbing lariat to the back of the head. I love his offense, very innovative is Lance Archer. Yes, a lot of violence, a lot of intensity, a lot of rage, but that's what brings the success. And, and Jake knows that, Jake Roberts knows that. That's how Jake was during his prime. Paying attention. And Janela, well, the thing about Janela, he has no fear. I mean, Joey Janela does not sweat anyone. I, his brain doesn't work like that, so. I mean, I don't know why you'd want to get in the grill and, you know, try to, you know, mess around with someone like Lance Archer, but Janela, Janela don't fear. I mean, Janela does have the strategy of, uh, he can, oh, jeez, God. Just suplexed him out of his boots very nearly. Snapping like the least suplex. We've seen him do that before, Lance Archer. And look at those eyes, man. He's just so locked in and focused. Janela's strategy is almost to, to antagonize larger opponents, to, to get them so pissed off that they actually make a mistake. And, oh, my God. Tear your peck up right there. Pineapple Pete again. Look at him. Rapid fire shots, a big right hand, followed up by a high chop. Oof. He's eating those chops, his Lance Archer. Ooh. Oh, wow. See you later. He, oh, man, that was just, what a forearm shiver. Rick Knox needs needs to check on the eyes yeah. of Pineapple Pete because they looked like they were spinning into the back of his head like a slot machine. Yeah, I agree with you. That was ugly. And now Archer. Yeah, he, and you can see Pineapple Pete on the mat. He's trying to come through. He doesn't even know that that, that arm is moving like it's moving. Look at this shot. Oh, man. Just turning in midair. One, two. No. 
Pineapple Pete maybe on, on instinct alone kicking out right there, Taz. Yeah, Pineapple Pete showing a lot of heart. I got to say, I've been a little hard on him on commentary. Yeah, I don't really like him at all, but I will say he's shown a lot of heart uh, in this matchup here with, with a very nasty and uh, aggressive. Yeah, yeah Pineapple Pete not, okay. not backing down from this fight. You know, walking into this match, he, he had to know that the deck was stacked against him. It's a very high deck, about six foot eight. And look, he's a yeah. demented individual. <laughs> just another forearm right to the face. Just winding up that big right shot from Archer. He's got Pete up on the corner. Oh, buddy, here we go. And this could be the end of Pineapple Pete's evening. He's fighting. Oh, he fought out of it. That's the key. If you can get out of that and just fall back, even though it's an awkward landing, at least you're not in midair. Get ready to get driven into the mat. Oh, boy. Pineapple Pete escaping the blackout, but now Archer with the goozle. Pete fighting free, though. Oh, yeah, he got out. He's chopping and punching, chopping and punching. Quick hand right there. Archer bull rushes him into the right. The Pineapple Pete lowers his chin and just knocks Archer down to one knee, Taz. That's the first time this match. Well, that definitely will alleviate, the, alleviate that size when you headbutt someone in the jaw area. Uh-oh, the blackout's coming, though, buddy. You ain't getting out this time. Pineapple Pete planted, and oh, man. Just that claw smashing. Listen to that. Oh, that reverb, that echo of the man's skull driving to the mat. Oh, winner of this match, the Murder Hawk Monster, Lance Archer. Every match, in my opinion, that Lance Archer has, he just amps up his intensity more and more. And now I, he's not done. He's not done with Pineapple whoa, 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 Pete. Look at Janella. Joey Janella. He's got a leaf he's blower. Got a, <laughs> <laughs> That's a leaf blower. Joey. Where the hell did he get a leaf blower? <laughs> Joey Janella, evening the odds. Bringing that leaf blower, but when Janella and Archer meet at Fighter Fest, it will be one on one. The bad boy never dies. The bad boy never dies. Well, Joey Janella, that remains to be seen. Night two of Fighter Fest, July 8th. Lance Archer and the bad boy Joey Janella going one on one.